Hey friends, welcome back to Vincent Gigi's Super Channel G and talking about what's out right now, these incredible The Batman Lego sets have just dropped and you can only find them at the Lego store and Walmart. Walmart has the exclusive deal to have these out right now and then I'm sure others will sell them later but Walmart does have the exclusive deal to sell them at this moment them or the Lego store of course. And so um, we'll be building these and opening these really soon. And you're going to let me know in the comments if you want me to do these already. Let me know. Hey, Vince, let's check them out already. Because we're just going to glimpse over what we have here, what are in these sets as far as what the boxes say. And then we'll be building them real soon. So let's take a closer look. And let me tell you how excited I am extremely excited for this new Batman movie. And... Was it Robert Pattinson looks incredible as the Batman? He looks fierce. He looks even scary. And so, um, uh, man, I was surprised at how great he looks as uh, as Batman. So here's this Batman and Selena Kyle motorcycle pursuit set. It looks pretty cool. This is kind of a clunkier looking uh, motorcycle. Both of them kind of are, but either way. I love that we get these two minifigs and we get that bat signal right there. It would be, uh, wow, it even glows in the dark. That would be even more cool if it could uh, light up. And I'm sure you will probably modify it in some way. But yeah, that looks cool right there. It looks just jewel thief. And look at this incredible looking Batman right there. So I'm definitely digging that. Look how great that looks. Look at that symbol. And so, there he is right there. And so this is, uh, wow, that looks so cool. This is the Lego version of this. How awesome is that? I love how they always do that. Very cool, just the Lego version. Oh, side by side, there we are. Super cool. All right, that looks great. And then interestingly enough, this time they put these over here. So there we are. And then I'm a little sad because my box has a big crease in it. And so look at that because something <sighs> fell on it. And uh, I normally try and buy my Lego sets with as close to perfect boxes as I can. But this fell in the car and I'm sad because it's my fault it got smushed. All right. So this is Batmobile, the Penguin Chase. It comes with these two minifigs. Look at that. Again, on that side now. And look how incredible this looks. And this Batmobile is kind of reminiscent to the one that was Ghost Rider, uh, the Spider-Man set with Ghost Rider, and I believe Carnage. It's not the same, but it's just reminiscent and looks so outstanding. And I love how it shoots out right here. And Penguin, you're not gonna get too far if you're just running on foot, buddy. You better be in a vehicle. And even that won't do, but a gorgeous looking Batmobile. I love how it's just like a, looks like early 70s muscle car. So who knows, uh, I'm not sure what it is, obviously, maybe we'll find out, or maybe it's modified, who knows, but um, what a beautiful looking, uh, 70s looking muscle car, maybe even late, late 60s, but um, looks just unbelievably fierce, supercharged, everything. So, and look at how these wheels and tires look right here. So you push that one here and fires that out. And this is just a beautiful picture right there. Great shot, guys. Man, it's beautiful artwork right there. Okay, so next, let's get a little closer. And come a little higher. Next we have six minifigs. Look, the Batman, the Riddler, Lieutenant James Gordon. So he's not a commissioner yet, notice. Selena Kyle, Alfred Pennyworth, and Bruce Wayne Drifter. So, very cool. This is Batcave, uh, the Riddler face-off. I don't know if he'd be running around in the Batcave. I don't know if that happens in the movie, but clearly he's got a cell phone with him. Um, and then <laughs> Lieutenant James Warden is like, running around in a circle. So, but man, this is some beautiful detail. Beautiful detail right here. And look at the tools in his workshop. Look at his computers right here, computer screens, monitors, and 
delicious. All of this just looks so great. Batman's tossing this. There's Alfred. So, yeah, it just looks absolutely great. There's even a magnifying glass here because it's like his desk. So, this looks so great. And we have Catwoman up here. Selena Kyle. I wonder if she looks a little bit different or not from the other set. I hope it's not just the exact same figure again. Because that would be unfortunate. A missed opportunity. But again, look how great this looks. We can even put the sets together and have uh, the Batmobile go here, apparently. So that looks awesome. And then the motorcycle. So, hmm. I'm like, that motorcycle doesn't... Oh, it does. So this one's different than this one. Look at that. It is... How different is it really, honestly? Because it looks like it may be, may be almost exactly the same, if not exactly the same. And only this is different, it looks. But I guess we'll find out once we build them all. But I was like, he's gonna have two motorcycles? Interesting. So, there we are. I love how this slides out right here. And it looks like they did, they catch him, put him behind this. Hmm. And check this out. Of course, they already revealed the whole secret. It says, to the Batman. But I love how it's got this red decoder. Clearly, we can see through it. That looks awesome. And those show us lighting up, but I doubt they light up. Because just like this computer is showing that it's lit up. But that'd be cool if it did. And I wouldn't mind paying just a couple bucks extra for that to happen little LED lights or something. There's Selena Kyle again. So that looks awesome, look at that. And this looks like the Riddler, but in red. Oh, there's another decoded thing. And of course, without it, it still looks like just a bat symbol. So, man, there's beautiful details right there. Okay, and last but not least, we have this incredible and this beautiful Technic, the Batman Batmobile. And batteries included, so this one does light up. So I'm excited about that, and I hope it lights up several places. But um, this is clearly not to scale with our minifigs, and um, that's not really what it's for. And like actual size, compared to my hand, that's how big that wheel is. So I'm excited to see that. Oof, let's take a step back. This says light brick functions right there. Red light brick and a yellow light brick. So one of each. That's cool. And wow, this is 17 inches long. And I think that's how long the tumbler is too. But the tumbler is not a uh, Technic. So look how awesome that looks. The detail inside the car. There we go, that looks awesome. Looks like a red and a yellow. And that'd be awesome if these light up too from it, but I guess we'll find out. I guess we'll find out. Well guys, let me know what you think of these sets. Are you excited about us getting these built? Which one do you wanna see first? Or do you just can't wait to see all of them? We gotta build one first, so which one do you wanna see first? And uh, how soon do you want to see this? Do you want this to be the next thing we review? Let me know in the comments. We'll be talking to you soon, guys. Thank you for hanging out with us here today on Vince and Gigi's Super Channel G. Peace. Talk to us in the comments. Give us a big thumbs up, and we'll be seeing you soon. Bye.